huge. Are women paid less while serving in the military as well? You know, I don't know the answer to that question, but I do know that they are fighting as hard as they can just for the basic equal opportunity to go to the front line. It sounds to me, is it Carter? What is the man's name over the military? I want to say Ash. Ash Carter. Ash yeah. Carter. It sounds to me like he's open and um, things are turning toward equality for women, but I'm sorry, I don't know the answer to that question. But I do want to emphasize when they come home, they're not equal because the Equal Rights Amendment hasn't been ratified. Exactly. And, they, and, I'm, and I'm sure that they're not being promoted internally um, very often as well. You know, that's, uh, it's probably not that common, you know, <laughs> for women to be in leadership roles at this hard. point yet. So, I'm sorry, what maybe did you say, Portia? Military, maybe some military women will come on and make some comments. And um, I do know that we have, some, we have some candidates that are going to be running, or that are running, um, that are endorsing Bernie, and I'm trying to get them on, um, and some of them are veterans. Uh, one is um, a woman and one is also a man. I'm hoping to talk about those specific topics. So, um, maybe I'll be able to give you that answer, Portia, <laughs> and find out. Because I think that's important for us to know. We should know how are they being treated in the military. I know that we worry about it federally. We, you know, we, when we hear like minimum wage or whatever the things that are being done for federal workers, it sounds great. But I think a lot of people working at Walmart and Home Depot and you know all these grocery stores and, and gas stations that the regular workers are also wondering well that doesn't apply to us you know and I think military also feel the same way sometimes too so you mean the, what doesn't apply the Equal Rights Amendment or yeah well like you know when you're talking when we were talking about whether women are paid equally in the military you know it's the same thing in in, in all lines of work but for us to, it's important to acknowledge that our military service um, they're sacrificing something that's really, really big that we need to make sure they're taken care of. So. There's an amazing veteran, and you might want to start following her. Her name's Diana Danis, D-A-N-I-S, and if she was on the show with us tonight, she could answer that question. <laughs> but, but Maybe no, we'll invite know. her on and see if we can get her on here <laughs> to talk I about know. it. I don't know. I, did, I haven't asked her who she supports for president, but um, she's an amazing veteran, and she's she's a very, very fierce fighter for the Equal Rights Amendment. Wonderful.